Hey everyone, it's Marissa. Good morning. Um, it is 4th of July. So those of you who are off today and those of you who are possibly working, um, just wanted to say have a safe and fun holiday today. I'm just going to stay home today and just hang out with the fans. So anyways, this video has, um, I keep on forgetting to do this video and I need to just clean everything from the party away but those of you guys know that my daughter had her prom and then right after prom like two weeks right two weeks after prom she graduated and then a week after that we had a um graduation party so i just wanted to show you guys what i made um she didn't have a date for prom this is her senior prom um and her and her a lot of her girlfriends decided i guess that's the new thing now is not to have any dates so her and a bunch of her girlfriends just went um, without dates and they were each other's dates I guess but it was so fun um, when we took pictures to see all of the girls and even the, when we went there the guys that the girls who had dates um, they all just hung out anyways so it was just like one big happy family <laughs> when they were taking pictures at prom and my daughter says at, even at prom they don't like hang out with just their date they hang out with a big group of people so um well that's just my daughter's group of friends friends anyway so that being said because she didn't have a date and it was just her and her girlfriends we decided to save money on a um corsage and make one so my daughter's favorite color is yellow her dress was yellow and she loves succulents and daisies so we kind of like um came up well i came up with this but she did pick the flowers so we made a corsage and these are all fake flowers you guys and all these were purchased from michael's and hobby lobby and um they were all on sale so win for mom not having to pay a lot of money so what i did was let me just show you the back we used a hair tie and then um here's my circle <clears throat> felt that i keep in my craft room for projects but we purchased the um I think it was eight and a half by 11 felt, but it's not the um, pliable felt. It's like a stiff felt. So that's what we use to um, hot glue the flowers on. And before I did, at first when we tried to do it, I, I just couldn't, I was not in the mood to like try to um, do this. So I put it away and then like a week later I went back to it and it, I just put it together like in five minutes. So what you do is, and these are for you moms who have um, kids still that are going to be in high school and just wanted to show you guys so that you can make this uh, an idea for your daughter. Um, oh, and even uh, one of my daughter's friends made her corsage and then she made the, um, the boutonniere, is that what it's called? For the guys. So they had the matching one. So that's a great idea for you crafty moms out there. Um, <clears throat> so what I did was I first cut off the, um, the flowers, but don't cut off all of it. Otherwise your flower will come apart because that's what my daughter did. So you want to place it to where you think it looks good. And then once you have it placed in the right position, then you go ahead one by one and you, um, glue the flowers down. So don't. Um, place it all where you want it and then take off the flowers and then start gluing just leave it and then glue one by one so that way you don't lose your place but we got some baby breaths in here and I told her to add these little pink flowers just to give it some color should we have this flower and then I love the little succulent she wanted she insisted to have a succulent in there so we found this succulent at Hobby Lobby and it was like a bundle so um, we took the smallest succulent from there some baby breaths again and then we have some uh, some leaves some green leaves so let me show you what it looks like so look at how stinking cute that is and it matched her dress perfectly so that is the corsage that I made for my daughter for her um, senior prom and then for her graduation party this is not my idea. I saw it on um, Pinterest and I just took it a step and just added bling to it. So um, 
this is what I made. You guys can pause it. Get this idea. I got this from Pinterest. Um, I just added this um, curling ribbon here. I added some bling and then the, the stickers. And they're all from Hobby Lobby. Um, her, My daughter's graduation party was um, outside at a restaurant by um, our nearby lake here in Mission Viejo, California. There's a lake there that has houses all around the lake. And um, you have to be a residence of the city in order to use that lake so but they do have restaurants all around well on one side of the lake they have like a, like three or four restaurants there and um, the restaurant we had it at was at an Italian restaurant called Pepino's so it was outdoors in the patio and I thought this would have been perfect because you know if they get hot they can fan themselves but I really love the saying on here that's why I decided to do this and I put this on um, every table or every place every chair and look at that look how cute and all it is is these sticks that I purchased from Hobby Lobby as well and I just um, use double-sided tape to put this down so I did that and then let me get here for the centerpieces, I actually got this idea from um, Pinterest as well. Um, I made a few of these for all the tables. It's too big, you can't really see, but the glass here, the um, vase, is from Dollar Tree. So that's an idea if you guys want vases for your centerpieces, Dollar Tree, they're only a dollar. And then I just... Um, Put glitter on the bottom I mod podge it and then put a layer of glitter repeat and then at the end I put some kind of um, spray I forgot the spray but it's just to seal it in and I got this um, shred from Dollar Tree and then these are the elements that I put in it so I made this pom-pom and then I made this this is from Cricut I use my Cricut yes I busted out my Cricut and made this 2018 um, sign here. And then here's another Cricut item that I did is the star. And this is all glitter paper um, that I got from, I think I got this, I wanna say I got this from Michael's the glitter paper. And then last but not least, I made this one. Um, the tool is layered, so I have a blue tool because it's her, um, high school colors and then the silver um, smaller tool on the top and this paper right here is from Michaels and then I think I showed you guys this I'm not sure but this piece right here I had her pictures um, I made her picture really really small on the computer at work and then I cut it out with one of my um, one of my punches and then I put a you know those um, bottle cap sticky things I put it right on top so that's all I did so and then I put it in the jar and I made it the centerpiece and so you know it looks like that so and you don't have to use this just for graduation you can this is a great idea for um, birthday parties anniversaries or whatever you choose to um, celebrate so um, yeah I hope you guys like this video I, and um, I will have another video coming up soon so stay tuned but anyways I hope everybody enjoys their day and I shall talk to you guys later thanks for now